Today's tree uh, is a very big tree. We're going to call it a, uh, a BFT. Uh, it's a Brazilian rain tree, which a lot of people call a BRT, so we can say a uh, BFBRT. You'll have to figure out what I just said. I've kind of not wanted to do big trees on the videos. I wanted the one of the trees that I use to be accessible, to be easily found uh, by by regular viewers. Uh, uh, this is a, a really, really old, uh, could be close to 30 year old Brazilian rain tree. Um, it's grown by uh, a gentleman in the Brevard Bonsai Society. Uh, he passed away recently and I acquired it at auction. This was how I saw it at that auction. Uh, it's amazing. It blew me away. Uh, I know it kind of looks like that it needs a drink. Uh, the leaves do look kind of droopy and kind of pale, uh, but it's exhibiting what's called senescence. If you see the big buds at the base of the leaf, uh, that means that it's going to drop its leaves, uh, but we're going to help it out by defoliating it. Uh, yeah, it probably is a little dry right now. I didn't water it this morning. I always uh, give my trees the best bottled water. Not really, but it makes for a good joke. Um, I'm just going to give a little bit of this because before I touch these roots, I have a whole bunch of stuff to prune off. I'm going to cut off all these nasty thorns. Reposition the tree in the in the pot maybe put it in a bigger pot this is totally pot bound I don't think it's been repotted in maybe three or four years and I'm going to simplify the branch structure just a little bit okay let's take a look up the trunk from below I have to uh, get my hands up inside that thing look at the thorns when, a, when a, a plant starts to dry out, the abscisic acid uh, communicates to the cells to, to close off and stop growing. It doesn't mean that they necessarily die, but eventually it leads to that. Uh, it's the same principle on a deciduous tree in the autumn um, when all the leaves fall off. It's abscisic acid. Uh, on the legume, and on the Brazilian rain tree especially, it seems like when the old leaves want to fall off we have to uh, we have to help them along uh, most of the work I'm gonna do is uh, we'll, we'll do it in time-lapse because you don't really need to watch me for the next 20 hours working on this tree We are the three pendejos, bonsai and beer in the nook. We are the three pendejos, we pretend what we do is work. We drink beer all day, playing with our little trees, doing just what we please. That is until someone's wife calls up, now we are down to two, we need someone else, hey how about you, we are the two pendejos, bonsai and beer in the nook, we are the two pendejos, until the wife comes again to look, two pendejos. All the pruning has been done, now let's take a look at the roots. The tie down wire is actually embedded in the bottom of that trunk, that's what my finger is, is touching there. Uh, both sides. That means it's been in this pot for a long, long time. 
as hard as cutting off all those branches and all those thorns were, um, this is the real task and this is where I kill the very expensive tree or we make the very expensive tree into an even more expensive tree that's alive. Well, in that case... What do you call it? Tears of the Mountain? Yeah. Rum Kenya? Rum Kenya? Mm -hmm. Tell me when it's enough. Well, this uh, is very strong. It's like a... It's very strong, so <laughs> it depends how much you tolerate. Tamarind? <laughs> Tamarindo? It's spicy? No. Any other flavor? Nice. <laughs> I think I'll have another. You could get drunk off that very quickly. <laughs> Obviously, the first step is uh, cutting the, the wire out of the tree here. No! What you gonna do? Yes. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, that felt good. <laughs> <laughs> Handy dandy homemade oof, oof, homemade soil scraper finger revolver. I'm gonna wrap this up a little bit so we can put a little bit more soil and, and uh, we can get a little bit of life out of this. Or like I said, you know, kill it. Okay, I'm looking for some balls. Oh, really? Balls. B-A-L-L-S. So I'm seeing very minute amounts of the nitrogen fixing nodules. That little round ball right there. I am not seeing nematodes, which is an awesome thing because nematodes suck balls. They just don't suck the nitrogen fixing nodule balls. So those ni nitrogen fixing nodules, they take nitrogen out of the air and feed it to the tree and the tree in turn feeds it, or the nodules, which is the bacteria, um, sugar. And I know it looks like I'm being pretty drastic with these roots, but um, 
this is by no means a complete repot. Uh, call it a modified Florida repot. Um, we're just getting rid of all this nasty, unuseful stuff. So we're going to put some screen covering the holes. That's pretty standard bonsai stuff. Um, we call this a staple that we use to do it with. I'm going to make my staples with the loop going over the top in the shape of an L because my last name is Levine. So it's a type of branding. <laughs> of course I'm using my regular soil mix. Um, so today's potting session is brought to you by Super Mix. It makes your trees into super trees. I saved a little of the old soil so that I could put it into the new soil so we can reinfect it uh, with the, the bacteria so we have a good colony of nitrogen fixing nodules. your tip for today. Remember a couple videos ago I talked about this, the mesh office supply thingies you can use for sifting soil. Well this is a, a, like a pen holder. It's magnetic and put pens and whatever in it. And, uh, and it's also good for getting rid of the fines just before you put the soil onto the tree. And I still have a whole bunch of thorns I need to cut off of this. As an afterthought, uh, you'll notice I left some big knobs on some of the big cuts that I, I cut the branches off. Uh, you have to leave that. Uh, the Brazilian rain tree is known for, for dieback, and if you don't allow for the branch to die back, you end up with big dead swaths on the trunk. Uh, and here we are, totally naked tree in December, uh, tropical tree. Uh, you'll have to go to the blog post I, I wrote just recently. Uh, if you like the video, uh, please hit that, that like button. Subscribe. Uh, you can see me on Facebook, Instagram, all those things. And I will see you later. Bye bye. What? I need a break though. <laughs> Look. I'm being scolded. Quiet. Let's go back to the tree. <laughs> <laughs>